Hello, Jennifer Priest here with another back to school type project. And for this, I'm gonna be using duck brand tape. And I also have some scotch duck style tape and some composition books at back to school time. You can get these for about 50 cents, 25 cents at like Target and Walmart. And surfaces, brand new uh, multi-surface ink from Clear Snap and Clear Snap's new mustache roll graph stamp wheel. So let's get started. All right, the first thing I'm gonna do is apply some duck brand tape to my um, composition book cover. So I'm just going to take some duct tape. You can, um, there's a bunch of different brands. There's uh, duck brand, which is this one, the Scotch brand of tape, and then you know your basic like hardware stores have their own uh, private label. And there's all different kinds of colors and shapes, different price points. Um, these I got everything here at Target except for the surfaces ink. All right, so you're gonna open up your tape and apply it to the cover of the book. So I'm just gonna cover it. And you can either wrap it around or just cut the edge. So when I'm all done, I think I'm gonna go ahead and cut the edge. So I'm just gonna wrap this all the way around my book. And what the scissors I'm using are some Westcott uh, titanium non-stick scissors. What's really nice is that you can cut duct tape and everything. It, they totally will not stick. It's awesome. So I don't have to worry about these being all goopy or anything. After I'm done with this project, I can go back to cutting paper or fabric with them. And what I'm going to do now is just add some interest with my Rollograph stamp wheel. So it's about the same size as the duct tape, which is kind of cool because I can do a different color of stamping on each section here. So the first one I'm gonna do is the middle, and I'm gonna do that with the black. So I'm just gonna ink up my Rollograph stamp wheel really, really good with the surfaces. So I'm just gonna start rolling. And the stamp wheel, one revolution is about eight inches, which is wider than this um, notebook. So I don't have to worry about, you know, it not coming out right. so that I can clean this stamp wheel off. All right, so I have here about three or four layers of paper towel. And what I'm gonna do is um, put this cleaner, this is the Surfaces Official Cleaner from Clear Snap, and I'm just gonna put it directly onto my stamp and then roll it off to get it clean. Colorbox Crafters ink in snow, and my ink has just a little dirty, so just ignore that. And what I'm gonna do is ink this up so I can apply it to my silver. Yay! All right, 
so because the crafter's ink is a pigment ink in order to get it to dry really really well I'm gonna just emboss on it and this is just clear embossing powder now that that's all heat set and good to go I'm gonna apply my bling so I'm just gonna use a hot glue gun and run a line of hot glue across the front. And I'm not gonna have it go on the back and the reason is if it was on the back you couldn't write in the book because it'd be too bumpy on the back. So I'm just gonna cut it off and then do the next. 